Construction is now underway for an outdoor stadium in Port Loma to seat tennis fans for the San Diego Open at the end of this month. As our ABC tennis reporter Rena Nakano explains how the tournament hopes to make San Diego a tennis destination once again. A professional tennis tournament is coming back to San Diego for the first time in years. Little by little, it's coming together. The 2,000 person stadium seats at the Barnes Tennis Center in Point Loma. You're going to be able to watch some of the best players in the world really close. General Manager Ryan Redondo says it's an honor to host some of the biggest names in men's tennis. Players like world number no. five Andre Rublev and gold medalist and Wimbledon champ Andy Murray. San Diego County hasn't hosted a professional tennis match since La Costa Resort in Carlsbad lost its bid to host the Women's Southern California Open after 2015. That's why Redondo says the ATP's San Diego Open starting September 25th is a huge comeback for the city, something he says even Padres fans are sure to love. This is like being right next to a Tatis. Right. And so to see that level of athleticism and performance, if you're a, a sports fan, this is where you want to be. Just added to the main draw, San Diego's own Taylor Fritz and Brandon Nakashima. That's even better for you know, hometown guys to play right in front of their, fr their friends and family. Although the San Diego Open is scheduled as a one off event, Redondo hopes the success of this tournament convinces the ATP to make San Diego a tennis destination for years to come. You know what? We had such a great experience. It's a wonderful city. The stakeholders and the community members are so supportive. Let's look at San Diego in the future. Rena Nakano, ABC 10 News. Tickets are on sale now for the San Diego Open. A link to that will be on our website at 10news.com.